Hi everyone and welcome to the Free Range Diva. So today uh, I decided to do something a little bit different. There were a few things that I wanted to tell you about, things that I really wanted you to know, but I didn't want to do a whole bunch of separate videos to, to let you know about them. And uh, if you like this format, let me know uh, in the comments below. And I will do this uh, maybe once a month or so. But uh, yeah, so let's just jump right into this. First of all, uh, Face Mask Alchemy, the June subscription box is out and uh, it brings back a mask from their very first box and that is the Surfer Girl mask. This is it right here and uh, this mask has been a, reformulated a little bit. It now, in addition to its regular ingredients, it now includes pink clay and Hawaiian spirulina. So if you want to know more about this mask, and to actually see it in action. I'm gonna link my description, uh, my video of it uh, right up here and in the description bar below. And you can take a look at that. I'll also put uh, Marie's video where she talks about uh, the, the ingredients in this mask and why it's designed to work. It's basically um, formulated to address uh, someone who has been out in the sun all day to help their skin kind of recover and get back to normal. So um, it's a gentle mask, it's a beautiful mask, and, and I'll tell you quickly my favorite way to use it is with a creamy cleanser in the morning before I get in the shower. I will mix some in with that, put it on my face, and leave it there while I take the shower so that the steam can do its thing. So it's kind of like a flash mask, and then rinse it off. So um, anyway, uh, Surfer Girl is uh, uh, back for a second go around and I also want to let you know that on the Face Mask Alchemy website they now sell full sizes of some of Marie's more popular products so you can get a full size of the Sweet Marie uh, oil for example as well as the Kuule Kuuipu mask which actually made it into my favorites. So um, I'll link uh, the Face Mask Alchemy website. If you're interested in subscribing, all the info is right there to, to the monthly box. If you want to buy any of the extras, you can do that too. And um, yeah, enjoy it because it's a great mask. There is a workman right across the street with a saw set up. <laughs> and I've been waiting all day for the sun to come out so that I could get some nice lighting for you guys. And of course, at about the same time that the sun came out, he came out with his saw. So I apologize, you'll probably hear it in the background every now and then. Next up, I wanted to tell you about the Clean Label Project and a test that they did of 134 different protein powders from a, a couple of several dozen brands. They tested these powders for uh, toxins, 130 different chemical toxins like BPA, which is uh, an endocrine disruptor. It mimics estrogen in the body and is a driver of estrogen can cancers. They tested for heavy metals, for pesticides, and for chemical carcinogens. And the test results are now up on their site and uh, you, I will link it below so that you can go there and you know see how your protein powder ranked as far as how clean it was or how contaminated it was. In a nutshell, I can tell you that plant-based protein powder scored the highest in uh, toxin contaminants with Vega 1 being the worst uh, of all that they tested. And they tell you, you know, why they, they talk, you can read about their methodology and the independent labs that they used. And uh, as additionally, a couple of other highlights from the test include one protein powder contained 25 times the safety regulated limit for BPA. And 75% of the plant-based protein powders tested, tested high for lead. Uh, additionally, the cleanest protein powders w tended to be whey-based, and uh, plant fusion was the uh, cleanest of the plant protein powders that were tested. So a lot of information there, really good to know. You can find out you know, how your, your protein powder scored, uh, and um, if, it's, you know, if you want to make a change, or if you're good. Next, I wanted to let you know that private messaging on YouTube is going away on July 9th. 
after that day, not only will you not be able to private message anyone through YouTube, but all of your private messages that you may have currently will be deleted. So if you want to private message me or get in touch with me privately, the best way to do it is to use the email that's in the description bar below, the free range diva at outlook.com, or uh, you can go to uh, my uh, YouTube page and click on the About tab. And I also have an email there for business uh, that you can contact me at as well. In addition, additionally, you can contact me on Facebook as well as on Instagram if you follow me on those platforms. So there are lots of ways to contact me if you want to, you know, if you want to get in touch with me privately, um, you should be able to without too much of a problem. <clears throat> I apologize because I'm having a little bit of sinus drainage today, so I hope I don't sound too congested. Um, but yeah, it's <clears throat> coughing a lot and drinking a lot of water because uh, there's just stuff in my throat. A couple of weeks ago, I entered a giveaway at the Hitchcock Madrona YouTube channel. And uh, Hitchcock Madrona is a store in Seattle that sells uh, their own designs for jewelry, as well as other designers. Um, they also do custom jewelry. They also have uh, other fashion accessories that they sell at the store. And they were giving away this beautiful necklace. This is a design that they call the Tomboy Flip, and uh, it's three chains. You have uh, this black chain, which, is, which I uh, liken to gunmetal. There's also a gold and a silver chain that's part of this, this, uh, this particular design. And they call it the Flip because it's designed to be worn any way that you choose to wear it. You can wear it as I've done it here with uh, the black and, and gold on one side and the silver on the other side, or you can do something like, like this, yes, or you can, any combination uh, above of, you know, that you like, like you can do something like this, for example. Uh, but it's designed to be just a cool piece that you can layer with other jewelry pieces. Uh, as you can see, it's got high shine. Uh, you can see it in the light, I hope. And it's a very heavy weighted chain that just pulls, so it feels really comfortable on. And uh, <laughs> uh, it, it just looks, it's just a really cool design. In fact, if you go to uh, their website, which I will link below, uh, you'll see a lot of their designs, like there's one that uh, they do this bold, chunky gold cuff that is gorgeous. Um, and if you go to their YouTube channel, you'll meet Erica and uh, you'll get more of a sense of, of uh, her fashion sense, which is uh, very cool and eclectic. Um, I love her outfits of the day videos that she does because uh, she combines vintage and thrift with very uh, high fashion uh, and uh, her fashion sense is just really, really, um, you know, it's very, it's just really cool, I guess, uh, is, is the word I'm looking for. But check her out. If you stop by her YouTube channel, tell her I sent you and say hi for me. But uh, yeah, so I'm so excited to uh, have won this piece and Goodness, I seem to be on a roll. This is like my second giveaway that I've won this year, so maybe I should enter more, hmm? But, uh, yeah, so, yeah, if you want more info about this necklace or the site, I will link everything in the description bar below. Finally, I want to talk about uh, a couple of channels that I've been watching as well as a podcast that I've been listening to, and we'll start with the podcast. It's called Skin Care Talk Radio. It's hosted by uh, a woman by the name of Cielo Scent, who has this beautiful voice. And it's got uh, a greener, cleaner approach to not only skincare, but all of her topics, basically lifestyle. Uh, she has um, topics that cover food and nutrition. And because it's a podcast formula, she has, uh, you know, she, she has time to really go into detail um, on her subject matters, detail that I can't really go into in a 10 or 15 or 20 minute video. Um, and so everything is really well researched and 
um, very interesting and great background information. She has a video uh, on um, a green smoothie and not only does she give you uh, nutritional information of all the ingredients in it, for example, celery, I had no idea celery was such a nutritional powerhouse, but uh, you know, the, it's put together, it sounds just delicious and I cannot wait to try it, uh, you know, myself. So stop by, uh, check out her podcast. Again, it's called Skincare Talk Radio and I will link all the info on it below. Next up is a YouTube channel called Aloha Jen's Beauty Blog. And uh, Jen is an esthetician. She lives in Hawaii and uh, again approaches her approaches from a greener, cleaner perspective. Uh, products and techniques. It's a relatively new channel and a small channel, but uh, I did want to give her some love because I watched a few of her videos and uh, found them to be. Uh, very informational, um, good information. She has a very soothing and calming uh, presentational style, and she's really, really beautiful. So, um, you know, stop by, tell her I said hi if you do, and uh, check out Aloha Jen's beauty blog. I'll link it below. And then finally, the last channel that I want to talk to you about today is called Soothing Relaxation. And what it is, is it's music. It is relaxing music that uh, they, they have like a couple that they stream 24-7. Uh, I think one is piano music, and it's music for studying or meditation or just really pleasant to listen to while you're cleaning the house <laughs> or doing the dishes or doing whatever you do. It's just nice to have uh, uh, this very soothing music in the background. In fact... Let me just read to you here. This is some information that I came across. On a genetic level, it says that classical music raises dopamine levels. That's your feel-good hormone in the brain. And uh, it also improves synaptic function for learning and memory. Uh, it also says that uh, it reduces or down-regulates other genes associated with neurodegeneration. And uh, this is from a a finished study that was reported in Medical Daily. So listening to, uh, and although this is not quote-unquote classical music per se, it has that same effect. Uh, additionally, from the live stream, they also have uh, recorded music in different styles, like uh, one of my favorites is they have Celtic um, water music or something. So. All right, everyone, uh, I had, had one more blog I was going to talk about, but I think I'm going to save it for the next time I do one of these. Okay, so um, everyone, you know, if you get a chance, uh, I'm going to wrap this up now. So um, go ahead and check out uh, these channels and links and things that I mentioned. Um, hopefully you'll find this video helpful. If you enjoyed it, then uh, for sure uh, give me a thumbs up because that helps me out and I'd really appreciate it. And of course subscribe if you haven't already so you won't miss my next video. And aside, uh, I'd love to have you as part of the Free Range Diva family. So uh, that's going to do it for today everyone. Until I see you again, take good care of yourselves, have a great day, and I will talk to you again very, very soon. Bye everybody!